this is Practice Prepper, and today I wanted to review Greenworks' Digipro 40 volt electric chainsaw. Now this runs off of these batteries which I charge off of my solar panels, so it's the green way of cutting down trees. Uh, and I kind of like that because I never run out of fuel. I don't have to ever fill it up with gasoline, and if there was ever a crisis, with the exception of an EMP which would destroy my solar panels, I can kind of go with this forever until the electronics break down and then it's kind of a piece of junk. But for now, I'm pretty pleased with it. The batteries drop right down in here. I feel like they have a pretty good life. I can go for maybe, I don't know, 15 minutes, maybe more, uh, just, uh, you know, kind of, you know, cutting you know, through things. And I've got two batteries and I kind of swap those out and it works out pretty well. Hold it, I'm sorry, 15 minutes, that's kind of a vague way to describe it. Here's something more concrete. All the wood in this bay right here, that's just about one battery's worth. There were a few sticks in there when I started, but per essentially, what you see there, that's one battery's worth that you can get out of the battery. So they hold the charge pretty well, and my, my batteries are about two years old, so, you know, they're still kicking after that time. That's it. We can go back now. Sorry. These are some things that I've, I've cut through with it. This is getting towards the big side. Of, uh, of what you're capable of going through. It's got a 16 inch bar and you can see, yeah, I'll flip it around the other way, how it kind of gets through there. Um, you, could, you could do something a little bit bigger, but once you get bigger than that, it starts getting a little bit difficult. Uh, but overall, I'm really pleased with it. I like the way that it, you know, just keeps going and going and charging off the sun. I never have to fill it up or anything. The chain that comes with it is a little bit of a weird chain that I recently wanted to get a replacement, just a backup chain for it, and it was kind of hard to find one, um, but I don't really know that much about chainsaw chains and what all the numbers mean, uh, but I found it kind of difficult, and a lot of suppliers said, oh no, we don't have that, we don't have that, we don't have that. Um, I ultimately did find somebody, but I paid like 20 bucks for the replacement chain for it. Uh, but overall, I'm really pleased with it, and uh, it's something that I use all the time. Now, uh, I'll show you, I've got some boards set up over here, and I'll just show you kind of how quickly it cuts through those. Did I just say boards? I'm sure I meant to say logs. These are some trees that I'm uh, thinning out from over in the garden area to let some more sunlight in, and these are going to be my firewood for next year. This one here is not very thick at all, it's only about three inches, but it'll show you how uh, quickly I can get through this guy. Um, I've got kind of an unconventional stand here. Um, you know, you work with what you got, yo. So there's an on button, a safety, and then there you go. <laughs> And I could probably push through that a little bit faster if it wasn't on this slippery little toy wagon thing. <laughs> but I'm trying to keep it from flying off of there. But it really eats through them pretty quickly. I've been very pleased with it. I'd highly recommend one. I mean, obviously gas has its advantages too. But if you want something that you can just refill off of the sun's energy with your solar panels, the Greenworks Digipro 40 volt chainsaw is something that I've been very pleased with. That's it. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe and tune in every Friday at 4.30 New York time for a new video.